What's up YouTube, it's Fujipa26 here, and in today's video, I'll be predicting the top 30 best Spanish players. Leave a like and enjoy the video. What's up guys, thanks for watching my video. So I'm gonna give some explanations regarding the top 10 best Spanish players. So coming out at number 10, we have Saul. Um, for Atletico Madrid this season, he has been relatively good. I think he could even push up to an 86 rating, but I do think he yeah, will just keep him at an 85 rating. Moving into number nine, we have Danny Carval. Uh, for Madrid, he's been really, really good. I do think he is very underrated. I do think he will receive a minor upgrade. Could possibly stay at an 85 rating, but I do think he will go up to an 86. Coming in at number 8, we have the free agent David Silva. 
Um, we don't know where he's going to go yet for next season. Um, but I do think this season he hasn't been too great. That's why I did decide to give him a minus two downgrade. As he is obviously aging as well. Coming in at number seven, we have Luis Alberto. Um, he has 18 goal contributions in 30 games. He's been playing really, really well for Lazio. And I do think he will receive a plus two upgrade to an 86 rating. Coming in at number six, we have Parejo. He's been also really, really good for Valencia. Probably... Um, one of Spain's best midfielders. I did, did decide to give him a plus one upgrade as well because I do think he's been really, really good this season. Coming in at number five, we have David De Gea. Um, not really had his best um, year this year. Could even get downgraded to an 87, but I do think he did recover towards the end of the season. Um, so I do think he will just receive a minus one downgrade. Coming in at number four, we have Thiago from Bayern Munich. He's had a really, really good season as well alongside Kimmich in the midfield. Um, I did upgrade him by a plus one up to an 88 rating as I do think um, he deserves that upgrade after having a great season. Coming in number 3 and 2, we have Busquets, Busquets and PK. Both of them, um, I did rate them at 88. Busquets with a minor downgrade and PK staying the same. Um, I do think they both have had an okay season. Obviously, Boss are not having the best um, season. So, that's the reason why them being number 3 and 2. Coming in at number 1, we have Sergio Ramos. Um, the best Spanish player for me. And I do think he could even go up to a 90 rating. But, um, I do think, yeah, we'll just keep him at a... 89 rating as unless Madrid were to win were to win something this season. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll check you in the next one.